What's up, Buttercup? My only question for you is, why didn't you take off my mask? We don't care about who you are. We only care about what you can do. Why? It's too late. You already know too much. <coughs> See you around, kid. What are you doing here? Playing video games. You have an Xbox. Yeah, but now with Black Ops 3. Where were you? Doing with Oscorp. They're still trying to get my powers. Oh. Take a look at this. What is this? Uh, I saw it on my way out. There's some kind of gloves. I'll look into it. Okay. They let me play. Hang on, let me finish this match. Dude, just... Who is it? it it's a uh, Harry. I'll be back. Where are you going? To meet Harry. You better not be here when I get back. You know I will! What's up? What the hell is this? A newspaper? You promised me you'd stop taking pictures of him after what he did to my dad. Harry, it's my job, and for the last time, Spider-Man didn't kill him. And how would you know that? He's not that kind of person. And besides, your dad was a maniac. Don't you ever speak about my father that way. He was a good man. He wanted his best for me. Nothing less. He framed you. Made everyone think you were the goblin. In what world is that doing what's best for you? Screw you. Harry. Just get out of my house, Peter. How'd it go? I'm sorry, man. He doesn't understand. He still thinks Spider-Man killed his dad. Well, you didn't. Did you? No, of course not. I just... I just wish things could be different. Anyway, I found some info on this gloves. It says they use high-frequency vibrations to produce shockwaves. It says they can tear through walls and measure what they can do to a person. Did you bring the gloves with you? Um, no. What? Imagine what those can do if they got in the wrong hands. Go get them. Right. Well, what do you know? They work. Hey, long time no see. So what do you say you give me those gloves and no one gets hurt? All right, Mr. Shockman, give those to me and I'll stop embarrassing you. Where are you? You really can't miss me. All right, Shocker, give it up. It's over. What 
are you doing? Sorry. I didn't know when you were coming back. Did you get the gloves? Dude, that was probably our only chance to get those! I tried! I was too confident. I didn't think what would go wrong if I lost. That's not responsible. <sighs> it's okay. We'll get them next time. No, you don't get it. When my uncle died, I made a promise to him. I broke that promise. You, you never told me what happened that night. I don't like talking about it. Well, it's getting late and I should go. Yeah, see ya. Is he dead? Well, you see, sir, there was a complication. Tell me, did you kill him or not? The cops came and he got away. What am I paying you for? You kill Spider-Man and then you get your money. It's not that hard. Yes, sir, I'll get it done. Wait. Sir? I want to kill myself. Bring him to me and then I'll kill him. Where should I bring him? Same place we held him captive last time. There's one more to think. I'm sure I'll be lying low after this. How should I get him? Peter Parker. He takes pictures of Spider-Man. Find him and he'll tell you where Spider-Man is. Yes, sir. Talking about Spider Man taking his pictures of him. Tell him where he is. It's not how pictures work. If he hears me again, tell him I'm looking for him. And if you tell the police or anyone about this, I'll make sure there's a bullet in your head. Me up. I don't even have a mask. Shocker. It's what he calls himself. You think he can give me another mask? I don't know. Come on, man, you got the first one made. It took me like four days. How fast they can get one made? Maybe like two days if I'm lucky, or I can get someone else to do it. I can't risk someone else knowing my true identity. It's bad enough you're gonna Alright, I'll get that other mask made. Have any suggestions? No. Alright, I'll call you when it's done. Thanks. So, you wanted to tell me something. Yeah, first, I want to apologize for earlier. I said some stuff that I shouldn't have, and I'm sorry. So, that's all you wanted to tell me? No, there's more. I wasn't being a good friend. I should be there for you. I mean, you were there for me when Uncle Ben died. I've just been so caught up in myself lately that I don't know how to handle this. Yeah, I've said some stuff, too, that I shouldn't have. It's just been terrible without him, and now that I have the company, I have so much stress. There's something else. Yeah? I've wanted to tell you this for a while now, and... I just didn't know how to until now. Okay. 
I'm, hold on. Hello? Right, I'll be there soon. Hey, sorry man, I got a meeting, I forgot about it. Yeah, it's fine, uh, talk to you later. You bet. the plan. Bring Spider-Man to me. Yes, sir. Right away. Wonderful. <laughs> Gwen, there's something I wanted to ask you. No. Gwen, would you have the honor of being my girlfriend? Ah. Oh. Hey, girl, I want you to be my everything. Hey, girl, why you tell yourself, girl? Hmm? Hmm? Asking Gwen out? Maybe. What do you know about getting girls? Trust me, I know what the ladies like. <laughs> Anyway, a package came for you. Yeah, I'll put it downstairs. All right, ladies, man, let's go. What is it? Why don't you look? Whoa, you made this? No, I had a guy make it for me. What? I told him it was cosplay. <sighs> well, you gonna try it out? Yeah, just give me a sec. Well, how do I look? Like a hero. Shocker's calling me out, and I have to find him. You know it will be a trap. I'm counting on it. How about this? I'll check out Scorp while you're doing the Shocker. I'll try to find anything on those clothes. Okay, just make sure to be back for dinner. Friday's pizza night. Jeez, you had me over so much I practically live here. Yep, I'll see you in a bit. Here, sweet cheeks. I gotta say, I'm digging the new armor. It really brings out the crazy in your eyes. Oh. 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 Where am I? What do you want? I want to bring you to justice for what you did to my dad. To make you suffer like I did. Not in the same way. What are you gonna do? You'll find out. Harry, I didn't kill him. Lies! All you do is lie! You think you're a hero? All you do is ruin other people's lives. I'm just a man trying to do what's right. 
You don't know what is right. You have hurt more people than you have helped. The right thing to do would be to stop. Tell that to the people I've saved. You think you can stop this? The crime wave? You only put a dent in this. Besides, everybody still hates you. And I truly do not understand why you try and save these people. I will never stop protecting this city. It'd be hell without me here. It already is hell here. You can't save everyone. You couldn't save my dad. Please, you have to believe me. I didn't kill your father. I don't want to hear that. What are you going to do? I'm going to kill you. But first, I want to see your face before you die. <laughs> Peter, you're Spider-Man? Harry, listen to me. You killed my father? Harry, no, you have to believe me. Stop! I thought you were my friend. I would never do something like that to you. I was hoping I could make whoever was under that suffer more. Oh, I know I'm going to make you suffer. I'm going to kill him while you watch. Powerless, knowing you can't do anything to save him. Harry, this is between you and me. Leave him out of this. This isn't about him. This is proof that you can't save everyone. When my Uncle Ben died, he told me that having power came with a price. The price of responsibility. At that time, I didn't care. I heard it a lot, and every time I did, I just thought of it as being another one of Uncle Ben's lectures. But after he died, I started living by it. I became Spider-Man to help people, make their day brighter, and it worked. I was helping people and having fun doing it. But I wasn't following Uncle Ben's one rule, to be responsible. And letting Norman die and Eric get shot is my fault. And it was caused by my choice to be Spider-Man. And I've been thinking about it a lot. If I was never Spider-Man, everyone would be okay. So I am done. I am not going to let another person close to me get hurt again. Because Spider-Man is no more. It's the only way to be responsible. How could Peter Parker be Spider-Man? My greatest enemy, my greatest friend. How could you betray me? Ha 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 ha! Gah! Ha 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 ha! 